Hello everyone, welcome to Flamboyant Flavors. In this video, I am making incredibly soft and crispy focaccia bread. This is a no knead dough recipe, requires very less ingredients and you don't have to wait overnight. If you're not sure what focaccia is, it is a traditional Italian flat bread that can be served as side dish or sandwich bread. So let's take a look at the ingredients. Today I'm using digital kitchen scale to measure my ingredients. I have 10 grams of salt, 4 grams of instant yeast, 5 grams of sugar, 15 ml olive oil, 425 ml of warm water, and 500 grams of bread flour. In a bowl, take 425 ml of warm water, add 4 grams of instant yeast, and then add 5 grams of sugar. Stir in and let it sit for about 5 minutes. When you see a light foamy layer on the surface, add 15 ml of olive oil and 10 grams of salt. Mix in everything and then add 500 grams of bread flour. Gently mix in with a spatula or by using hands. If needed, add just a spoon of water at a time until you get a sticky dough with no dry flour left. Now cover the bowl and let it sit for around 15 minutes at room temperature. After 15 minutes of resting the sticky dough, I am going to stretch and fold the dough. So take some water in a separate bowl and wet your hands so the dough doesn't stick to your hands. Stretch and fold the dough five to seven times just like this and let it rest for another 15 minutes. Repeat the stretch and fold step for three times with 15 minutes intervals. Hey, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Please subscribe so you don't miss out new videos I post and don't forget to hit the like button down below if you like this recipe. After repeating stretch and fold step for three times, take about two tablespoons of olive oil on the dough and spread it. Coat the dough with olive oil. Then flip the dough and let it rest for two hours. I am using a rectangular sheet pan deep enough to make this focaccia bread. Drizzle some oil onto the pan first so the parchment paper stick to the pan nicely. Then add around three tablespoons of oil and spread it all over the parchment paper. The dough is poofed up nicely and now transfer it in the pan. Fold the dough like a burrito, turn it 90 degrees and then flip the dough. Cover it and let it rest for one hour. I had to change my sheet pan because the first one I used was not deep enough for focaccia bread. So I took a 9 by 13 pan that is at least 2 inches deep, enough for focaccia to rise in the oven when it's in the baking process. Preheat the oven on 430 degrees Fahrenheit. Take some olive oil in a separate bowl. The dough is nicely puffed up. Dip hands in oil and dimple it all over the dough just like this. My favorite topping is rosemary and garlic. I always coat rosemary with olive oil so it doesn't burn when it's in the oven. Place rosemary on top of the dough however you want. You can add your choice of toppings on focaccia bread. Drizzle the rest of the olive oil on top of the dough and sprinkle some garlic powder on top. This goes in the preheated oven for 20 to 25 minutes or until the top is golden brown. 
Once it's out of the oven, transfer it right away to a board or a wire rack so the bottom of the bread stays crispy and doesn't get steamy. Wait for few minutes to cool down before slicing. This focaccia bread is so tempting. It's like a pillowy bread, soft and crispy from outside. Let me show you how it looks from inside. I started making it in the morning and by dinner time, I had it ready. Freshly baked focaccia bread. Do try making it and this focaccia bread will become one of your favorite breads. Hope you like this recipe and please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Hit the like button if you enjoy this recipe. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.